Welcome back to the Roadshow this morning in the buzz. Before we get to the buzz, though, we want to let you know that the kiss, William and Kate, just minutes away, so we may have to cut to it live you and get the, the tissues yeah. out. This so. is the first time they've kissed. This is amazing. Ever. 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 First time they've ever kissed. Wow. I'm ever. so excited. There's so many people <laughs> waiting for this moment, so if we just stop talking, put up the pictures, you'll know. Anyway, so the wedding itself is over now, but the celebration is just getting started in London. Oh, the yeah. family is now Buckingham Palace to kick off round one of the big celebration today. The Queen is hosting a lunchtime champagne reception for the couple, and in fact, we're awaiting, as we said, their first balcony appearance in just a few minutes. We'll bring it to you as it happens. The Queen, however, will be leaving after that reception. I why? wonder why. She might be a little tired. Well, <laughs> Prince Charles is then going to host a private black tie reception at the palace with dinner and dancing. People are also still speculating where the couple are going on their honeymoon. But yes, before we get to question. that, let's just imagine this reception. I mean, what do you think it's going to be like inside there today? Well, I'm a little disappointed the Queen's not going to stick around. Mm. I think she could disco well, there later her with her yellow hat. And then she's just picture Dana Carvey in church chat. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> the church doing the lady. Dance. Uh, I think it'll be, I don't know, I mean, it's a new generation and things have changed. Yeah. It won't be mm -hmm. as stuffy, I think, as no. Princess Diana and Prince Charles mm -hmm. when they had theirs. Not that I was there, but, you know, just seeing the pictures yeah. from it. Yeah. Yeah. I think it'll be more modern. I think they'll, you know, I don't think they'll be doing jello shots or anything like that. <laughs> But I mean, no know, ice luges, you no, don't no, think? No, no. no. <laughs> ice luge. Martini, there will be no uh, beer. Yeah. No we beer. Know that. No beer. Yep. I, I saw a rumor, too, that Beyonce and Jay Z were going to perform at their what? reception. Because I wouldn't be they're surprised. Fans of them. I don't know, but, you know, just little things like that, you know, even just the music choice. And I'm sure, you know, they're a young couple. They want to celebrate. Them. Have a party. You know, and they're you slowly narrowing it down. They're like, yeah. okay. So, what was it? 1,900 people came to the actual ceremony. Now mm -hmm. they're narrowing down to like 600 for the first lunchtime, and then 100 at the nighttime reception. So they're slowly dwindling it down to there. You can so tell few. that times have changed, even just by looking at the hairstyle. I mean, look at Harry today. He's got like the messed up yeah. red do, hey, and the way Harry he's standing is kind of just like hunched. Like you know what I mean? Like when you look at the wedding of Princess Di, everybody was so rigid, prim like, and proper. Everybody just seems a little more laid back, like they're enjoying, mm -hmm. you know, just the celebratory feel of the day, and not so much about like the. The tradition, you know what I mean? Yeah, Harry was. So. I, Harry was. I just, you're right. He's like sitting there, like, when's the party start? I know. You know yeah. yeah. He looked you know, tired. I wonder if he went out more, last night. Yeah, he probably they did. Probably he probably did. got after you know? it. I mean, but he just came home from I don't, where? Where's he been? Uh, Antarctica, right? Yeah, with yeah. Penguin, with the, doing some. I mean, this guy is hardcore military. Yeah, he's all over the, the world. Yeah, doing that sort of stuff. But uh, we were going to talk about this, the honeymoon too. There's yeah. been so many people guessing. I know some yes. people have thought. I don't know if you you know this, but uh, William has a, a real affinity for Africa. Right. But so they got engaged, right? Right. But he's also taken some of his past loves before Kate to Africa. So a lot so of people that are saying go over well. probably won't play well. <laughs> I really hope that they go someplace warm and tropical. Yeah, I think some after Tahiti yeah. or some big. That's what I'm expecting. You need time to really debrief after such a big day. Mm -hmm. I think you need a warm as private as you can get kind of place. Did you go you someplace know? tropical on your honeymoon? I did. I did the Sandals Jamaica trip, and uh, it was great. Nice. Eight days, though. That's wow. one other thing, too. I always tell people who are getting married, don't make your honeymoon too long. Because you've got so much build up, like the week before is like all the planning. <laughs> I no, disagree. I, I know. I, I don't know. I just felt like eight days, it was like, I just wanted to get back home, and you know, and it was too much time detached from the real world for me. But <laughs> Patrick, Patrick, you wanted yours to be longer? No, yeah. Not me. We went to Bermuda, yeah. and mm -hmm. I, we went for, we had a, a one place for my, uh, for the first six nights or seven mm -hmm. nights, and then we added, I think, four or five more nights Did on you? that. Did Yeah. At the same place, we just booked more time wow, outside yeah. of the. But you just loved I was it in so no much. I don't know. I, I don't know. All I right. loved my honeymoon. Don't get me Hang wrong. Hang on. Oh my gosh. Here it is. Here it is. Let's just watch. Okay. Here they are. All right. Making their way up. She's gorgeous. Wow. Oh my goodness, don't disappoint us, William. What do you think he's going to, I mean, he'll be classy. Yeah, I think he will. All right, well, let's really They look so happy. Yeah, look at them. It'll be nice to show. Oh, look, oh, he's getting yeah, ready. He's you can tell. No, no, no. Oh. There are more people. We need more people he's out there. He's licking the lips. Oh, that's her father. Okay. He's licking his the lips. families. Oh my goodness. Okay. He's got to get ready. This is a big moment. This is. Patrick asked what they were doing a few minutes ago. I said, probably brushing their teeth. <laughs> Get ready. We live in a such a tight schedule. 
Prince William, he, he waves weird. See, he waves. Patrick. Weird. It's like a fast. Look at that. That's a weird wave. I don't know. That's a, that doesn't go weird for a dot for a guy. That's He's got a, a big hand. I don't know. It looks like it's yeah, like the, weirder than it. Like, uh, look at that. That's a weird wave. I'm sorry. That's not a weird wave. It's a royal wave. Come on, let's see that smooch. We want to see it. We've been waiting four hours. Come on. <gasps> come on. Come on. Ready? You said you ready? Oh. All right, let's go. There it is. We, that's what we waited for. Yay! It's official. Well, so many people were, so many people were watching. They had to make sure it was appropriate. Patrick wanted a little more, but you probably can't get too into it with that big of a crowd. So he right. looks so uncomfortable. No, he doesn't. <laughs> Courtney, back to you. Oh, while you're goofing on him, I was wiping a tear from my eye. Okay. Oh. We're like three feet apart, and it's so different over here. But yeah. we're, we are all glued to the screen here on the live vlog, which is cool because they're watching on TV. They're watching it here with us. So let's see what time they woke up today to catch all the festivities. We'll start on the live vlog. One artist told us that she's been up since 5.30, and Joe says, well, I haven't been watching the royal wedding since 4 a.m. I have been keeping myself updated right here on Fox with the live shots every now and then. It's kind of hard to escape today, isn't it? Here's our poll right underneath the live vlog. Are you watching the royal wedding? A, yes, I've been up since the beginning be no but I'll catch the highlights see no I'm not really interested we've got a bunch of comments on our Facebook page and some from people we haven't met so this is very cool they're joining us on a fun day Amy Olivier says I've been up since four Andrew says I've been up since midnight Susan said she's watching and enjoying a cup of English breakfast tea and Lisa Perry says yes even my husband got up with me so uh, it looks like everybody's tuned in today not not gonna get much work done but but that's all right we'll see what you guys say in the live poll at the end of the show but